With players on the brink of suspension, Celtic left out Scott Brown and started with Mark Wilson and Joe Ledley on the bench. In came their two Koreans, Cha Doori and Ki Soon Young, and Freddie Ljungberg made his first SPL start. Out for St Mirren, on loan Celtic player Paul McGowan and injured Craig Dargo, plus Van Zanten, Travner and Moy were subs. In, McCausland, Mayer, Goodwin, Craig and McLean. An early chance for St Mirren. And it's Michael Higdon over the free kick, blocked by Freddie Lundberg. And Kenny McLean's follow-up effort is well off target. While Michael Higdon was appealing for something here, blocked by Lundberg. And that might just have come back off his elbow inside the area. And Higdon was looking for a penalty. Charlie McGrew taking the ball out of defence and looking to start something in attack. It's Chaduri. Up goes Stokes, and that was close, and it's certainly as close as Celtic have been in a disappointing first half performance from them, low-key, lacklustre, that was better. Kayal for Forrest, coming in off that touchline, it's direct, it's positive, and it's not too far away. The youngster bringing the fans to life, and they haven't had too much to shout about so far. Mulgrew. Stokes trying to get on the end of it, that's key. Ljungberg bursting into the box. In goes Goodwin and McGregor. Got in each other's way. And Paul Gallagher had to boot that clear. Ljungberg again, hauled down by Hugh Murray. And the former Arsenal midfielder bursting into life here. And that was a problem in the six-yard box for St Mirren. Danny Lennon encouraged by what he's seen from his team in this first half, very organised. And here's a chance for Michael Higdon as Celtic went to sleep just ahead of half-time from Paddy Craig's corner. No marking, what a chance. Right at the start of the second half, after four and a half months out injured, Neil Lennon orders the return of Sean Maloney. He's a Geary. Stokes. Teasing, tormenting, and a good ball in. Beaten away by Gallagher. And thumped away by Hugh Murray. Celtic looking for better in the second half and it won't take much to beat their first half performance that's the end of the match for Freddie Lundberg and the Celtic fans will now see the substitution I think they've been calling for and looking for it's enter Chris Commons Chaduri Biram Kayal Celtic have certainly had plenty of the ball can they do something with it? Sean Maloney looks to spark something. It's Cummins! It's 1-0! And it's a massive sigh of relief around Celtic Park. 12 minutes from time. Finally for Celtic, the breakthrough. And eight minutes on the pitch is enough for Chris Cummins to show what he can do. Blasting past Paul Gallagher here for 1-0. And Celtic now on course to extending their advantage at the top of the SPL. Relief for everyone, including the manager. John Potter's free kick. And that seemed to skim off the head of Darren McGregor, and I don't think anyone's more surprised than he that Callum Murray is pointing to the corner flag. Corner given, and I don't think Charlie Rhee had anything to do with this. In from Travner. Higdon a problem for Celtic. And Potter! Great strike. And not far away. Just rose a little bit too quickly. But this a uh, big worry for Celtic in the closing stages. Danny Lennon looking for one last effort. Jim Goodwin's free kick. Up goes Higdon. In goes Potter. What a chance! And he's dragged it wide. He can't believe it, St Mirren can't believe it. What an opportunity here to deny Celtic all three points. He hooked it.